Hello, it's the devil here. Uh, in this video, we're gonna check uh, the drum plugins again. And what we're doing is taking the MIDI information and we're gonna convert that to audio tracks. And we're gonna first, we're gonna use addictive drums. And we'll just drag it over there. And then we have addictive drums here and the first thing we want to do to be able to do the conversion is we're gonna go to the kit and then we have an option here and we're gonna put all of them to a separate out post fader all right, so that's all done. And then, of course, we need some MIDI information to uh, convert. So let's take that one and drag it over there. Here we go. And then on this section, we're going to click on that and expand. Click all of these. There we go. And I usually, this is just for, uh, I like to make my drums red. And then we are set. We click on that, make sure it's selected. Go to track, transform, transform to audio track. Render all channels, preserve instrument track state, so we can go back to MIDI and click OK. And then it will run its process and we will have uh, audio tracks of the MIDI information on separate tracks for some fun mixing. And after we're done, uh, after I'm done showing how to do, do it in addictive drums, I'm gonna show how you do it on uh, free moto drums from IK Multimedia. Because that should be doable also. And I think uh, doing this in Appleton uh, is a different video. And you should be able to do it in this in any DAW. I mean, if you use Reaper, that's the free one. You should be able to do that in there too. All right, so here we go. And let's bring it so we can see the information. So there we go. And we can mute the master and then we can check So now we can you know control our mix here and if we would like we could uh, start adding effects and just for fun let's uh, put uh, some sort of reverb in uh, in the snare just to hear Let's see how it sounds. Let's put some plate. So there we have our snare. Whoosh, all the way wet. So yeah, there we go. All right, then let's see if we can do this in the Moto drums. So I'm going to remove all these tracks and we're going to go here, take IK Multimedia, Moto Drum and we probably have a mixer section in there too. All right, so mixer and here we go, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, blah, blah, blah. So let's do all of these. It's too late to turn back now. Oh, it was the right one. All right, there we go. Uh, now, uh, let's choose a crew from here, like that one. Let's duplicate that a few times. There we go. And uh, then, uh, Let's collapse that one and the same thing expand boing 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 choose all of those I'm gonna take these out of the way hide so now we have these are the mono drums same thing let's uh, quickly there we go now it's a single track uh, we have chosen that track transform transform to audio track uh, let's see how it works It's taking its sweet time. But hey, sometimes that's that's the thing. That's the that's the job waiting. <laughs> it's a lot of work and just sit around and wait. For me at least it is. Some people enjoy it, I think, but... Uh, usually I'm, I'm not one of those people. Alright, do your thing. More? Faster, faster. Faster of Muppet. How many tracks were there? It must be done soon. Well, was there like 20? It feels like 20. Still? It's still going? Huh? Maybe it's stuck in loop. Maybe it actually is. No. There we go. So, uh, then we have all of this. So, again, we can go here and I th think it did some extra in there. Did it run? Ah, oh, no, no. Yeah, okay. So... Uh
Ah, okay, so these are like just place holding. And there are, are actually actual tracks. They're actually quite what quite quiet, so I could just turn them up like that. Gain staging it is important. But yeah, there we go. That's how you do that stuff. So uh, for some fun mixing, and of course, I always do this with my drums. Make them red because the red one goes faster. Everybody knows that. All right. Uh, the next one about the video videos is going to be about MIDI mapping your uh, controller if it's not uh, uh, if it can't be found from the you know the most uh, common uh, kits that usually have a mapping in the program uh, in the plugin already yeah there you go hope that helps have fun but